On the internet, I have encountered many people who claim that blonde hair comes from ancient North Eurasians. Yes, you heard that right. The entirety of the trait comes from them, according to some people. The origin of this misconception lies in the Ketoji gene, the single gene that plays the biggest role in determining hair color. The first historical instance of this Ketoji gene is a font of Agara ancient North Eurasians. However, we have to keep in mind that this isn't the single gene that determines hair color. There are multitude such genes, and it is unlikely that they all come from ancient North Eurasians. To explain what I mean, I will use a personal example. Both me and my little sister are blonde. I'm more on the gingerish side, she's more on the grayish side, but we both have light hair. However, neither of us have the Keto G gene. That means we got our lightness from different genes, most likely those other genes we acquired from European hunter-gatherers. Sure, Keto G might have come from the ancient North Eurasians, but most Europeans do not even carry the derived C allele for this SNP. Only 28% of North Europeans carry either one or two C alleles for this SNP. However, by my estimation, something like 90% of Northern Europeans are blonde. That means that even if the presence of the C allele guaranteed blondness, only one third of blondes would be carriers of the Keto G gene. Most blondes do not owe their hair color to the Keto G gene. Blonde hair as a trait does not come from ancient North Eurasians. Only one SNP does. All the other SNPs that contribute to blonde hair of modern Europeans do not. To claim that blonde hair as a trait comes from ancient North Eurasians is essentially equivalent to claiming that Avars of Dagestan, Amerindians, Baloch of Pakistan, Pashtuns of Afghanistan are lighter in hair color than Finnish people are. They have more a &E, so they must be lighter in hair color, right? It should be obvious and clear to everybody that blonde hair does not come from ancient North Eurasians. The Kito G gene does. Blonde hair as a polygenic trait doesn't.